And our name is written in the book. There are things that go on. They look at how you do your works. Amen. After getting saved, you begin the journey of salvation. What works do you do? The works, what is good? We shall get a reward. Although, many will not get a reward. Amen. The works, let me talk about them. It's not evangelism. Not chasing demons. The works that are given in the ministry. The works that are given in the ministry. The works we do on our own. The works we do on our own, they fall under. Uh, bearing the fruits. You will have love, geopolitics. The love is of actions. Your friend was robbed when he was going to purchase goods. You get some money and you make a contribution. There is a work you're doing. That work is written down. You have seen a woman who has given birth. But she has got the old cross and torn it and is the one using to carry the child. You go to the shop for the kids and you buy the clothes for the kids and bring. There is a work you're doing. So it, uh, clocks in the morning when the house of your neighbor fails. The man is old, the woman is old. And you put all that aside. You do something to recover the house. You are doing a good job. And many other things. That you never child was just but because of a textbook. You ask how much? 30,000. And you have 300,000. You get the 30,000 and you buy it. And it goes back to school. You are doing the work. There are a lot of works. If you talk about them, somebody can move from home with a slasher and slash it behind to uproot and even slash. Is that action? No. He has come to do a work in the house of God. That is written. You may not do it here. You get your home and the farmer. And you go to the web. You slash the web. And even you make the web. Those are the works we will look at. To reward everybody according to his works. Some are done with their hands. Others you touch in your pockets. Amen. There are two people who have got broken in the way. And 
and you tell a man to refill those potholes and the pay him. Are you government? Are you government? No. But the concern the one again. So before God you have done our job. Amen. We come here and sit. And you sit behind. You see the shadows. It's strong. You don't just laugh. No. You are now digging the potholes in the air. And to put a curse upon you. You go slowly. Go and buy two shirts. Bring them when they are good. And give him in secret. You have the shirt. You don't put your one in there. You come and you find the shirt. You've covered it well. After service, you call him. Let they have something to tell him. He comes when he's annoyed. Why? When somebody is in a bad situation, in most cases, somebody will come to town. Some people do bad things to others because they start to set their hearts. There is a way we can walk among those people and remove that toughness. We can make people good in our world. Others, because of anger, others rent from the house. Six months, he has not paid a lot. You've not managed to pay house. Now they want to take him another place. So it's between death and life. If God you don't do something, I will commit suicide. The person determined you to strangle yourself when you find you can strangle you. What's yours? If he has surrendered it to strong himself, why can't he strong somebody who is not him? Amen. He can strong another one. If he fight, if you give food to the other person, there is a work you've done. So You've made it to survive there. Yeah, he decided to strong himself so that they fight for. Not all people know to buy cars. The developers are going wrong. Some come from home in the mind. From here, if I don't get an answer to my situation, I'll fall into a truck. Amen. I will not make you to raise up your hand that you will remember when it happened to you and put the rope in your pockets. They let you in the church. If I don't find a brother giving me wisdom, I will strong my soul. And if God is merciful, you find a brother in and God puts the Holy Spirit in a brother. When he sees you, he smiles. To find somebody smiling, it is also a solution. 
Their pupils and smile. I asked to go to the post when I see first I'm giving 50,000. I was going to not spam on you so. You find it being removed. I've got 50. I've finished. I can go to Masaka. And I take my mother this. I like mom's mother. Let me tell you people who have a giving heart. You, you get food and take somebody, take to serve, so say, I pay me young. In your lap, in your ignorance, there are many people you make to survive this. Who knows that? The brother that I've been through ever been in a situation and somebody gives you something and you say miracle and somebody has delivered you. When I don't get money for the suit, I'll be the woman. And abandon the wedding. When you're packing your bag in the morning, then they call you. These, are, these people are fed up. You receive it. That offers the wedding. The time you sit here. Now there's something that will be binding the heart and the disease. Then you call your friends that you, where are you? Where Praise the Lord. That's why giving is good. In any way. Money, promise, food. There are people that you make to survive in that time. God will never abandon you if you are telling to do that always. That's why the Bible says, Give it. You're more blessed than receiving. It's more blessed to give than receiving. In giving, there are people who make you survive when you don't know. Amen. Somebody was getting a partner to be head of wife. And the message comes. You will open and it is a hundred thousand. The praying changes that you survived me. <laughs> now she likes the chapel store when the other has run to the shop. Comes back to 
the sugar, sugar, and the granite. There are three names that you have missed, and they made you lose the Italia. You survived the panel and you lose the person. Somebody survives going to the prison and also surviving death. And you children remain there. Behind is somebody who has done that and is you. There is something that you have given. That's the Bible says that it is more blessed to give than to receive. Amen. There are people that you need to survive. Those who are given, they would have survived. To do what? On everything that you get, you pick a little and you give. Don't give always your friends. You think about others. Think, think about the neighbors. Let me send a kilo of granites. If you don't send out food, you can take the granites. There is a spirit or spirits that you make to survive. Praise the Lord. Where in space? They are going to look at the works that we did. Amen. And everybody will be given the way it works. There will be a condition that they don't pass it. They don't force you. There are people who don't give under the earth. Except if that person has been forced. That when you give a pot of sugar, you will get a bar. And when you mind this business, you will give in. Such people, those ones that have been seduced, don't get. What is also happening? His wise knows that you cannot get it from your heart. You are forced. And they put something to attract you. That when you give a quart of sugar, God will give you a sack of 50 kilograms. You don't give. But you get a business. If I give the quarter and get 50 kilograms, I'll give. God doesn't have a deal with you. Nobody has understood that. Whenever you live after you have been seduced, and they seduce you, don't expect to be rewarded from God. The Bible says, God loves a cheerful giver. Then that comes that I'll take the thing to this man. I'll take this proper to somebody. You prepare it with your good heart. When you're happy, the man God looks at your heart when it is happy. Every step you take when you're happy. When you take your gift to that person, God pays. Praise the Lord. When you are in this place, God will look at all that that we 
is going to pay us what we have done on earth. Everything that you've done in earth. When our hearts love. When our hearts are happy. When we are not lost. Amen. Are people at that point clear? Let us proceed. All the works that are done in such a way. You've taken your family to the well and prepared uh, it. The well is going to come. The family has come. But you have wisdom to see that the world needs to be green. You go with your family. There is a job you've done before God. That work. When you're in the space, you will be paid. Amen. The works that you, you, you were sent, the works that you commanded, there is a reward that is small. But the works you see and imagine, by the works you send your soul, this is my neighbor. He walks on the veranda. I see the children. I didn't see him cooking. Day and night. And that is over. I've not seen him or cooking. There is a problem. Amen. Whether you buy food, if you are not very close, I don't give you wisdom to buy food. He may pour into the trailers. Give him 10,000. My neighbor. I thought giving you a cure of portion. Amen. Amen. She will take it to cry when you see him. Not by tears. Say, God, you still love me. The blessing you're going to get there, don't know it. Amen. It was a half past seven. I found a brother in my Lord Pastor. Uh, leaning against the wall in the shop. Near the cupboard. He knew the place was far. He was happy to see him, told him, you, when I went back home. Told him. So God was merciful. Had he some money. He gave him some money. Looked at him. That God bless you for God. I've gone back home. I imagine it in the text. That you would have been stranded. And they expected a blessing. From there to day, you bring him, my friend, praise the Lord. The Bible, the Bible says that it's more blessed to give than to receive. Both of them a blessing. When you give me, I get a blessing. When I give, I get a blessing. But when I'm giving, that blessing is not added. When I give, it is a multiplied. 
God looks at the people of Metro Savannah. And when they remember, they speak. You don't know the problem somebody is having. Maybe they promise to chase that person in the evening. The 50,000 in the morning makes him to survive in chest. He goes to the landlord and told, tell him, have my support, make sure that goes. Those are two men. You would have passed today. Whatever remembers, he says, God, bless that person. We don't know what would have done on that day. God is faithful. He will bring his voice. So you are more blessed to give than to receive. You always love to give. Other than waiting to be given. Amen. There are people who started something back to ask for Christmas. On the 18th. Even up to now, they are collecting. That was my Christmas. My Christmas. But he has not got something in that say. That person sleeps on the veranda. He doesn't have a job, a plantation that's where he sleeps. Ah. Let me show you what I got in Christmas. To know that the day came and went. Am I talking to somebody? Praise the Lord. We say that you're speaking with me. The words are said. Praise the Lord. You get the microphone. In the one that have been spoken today, which one you say that this one? It has done well to my life today. Raise up your hand. You want to tell me that you have not had anything? God, continue to bless you. I, I have been blessed to hear that it is more blessed to you than to receive. That when I'm giving, the blessing. Even when I give, the blessing. But when I'm giving, I don't get more blessing. But when I give, that blessing continues. This person will continue to pray for you and say what you say. You have to give from the bottom of your heart. God multiplies the blessing. You can give something and you're going to save that person. One time, I was sick. I was at home without money. 
So When it's tough, but you can bring his heart back. Look at him. I'm blessed. Go and do like that always. I don't know what you are saying. I don't know what you are saying. I don't know what you are saying. I 